Hello, I'm Nat Cohan, president of the Center for Climate and Energy Solutions. Here at C2ES, we're focused on accelerating the transition to a net zero economy. We're committed to the idea that we can cut carbon pollution across the United States while growing our economy and helping businesses and communities thrive. In last night's State of the Union address, President Biden highlighted the hundreds of billions of dollars of climate and clean energy investments and all the jobs and economic opportunity that brings that's being spurred by policies like the Inflation Reduction Act and the Bipartisan Infrastructure Law. And those laws do represent a historic step forward, but we have much more to do if we're to achieve the ambitious goals that President Biden set of cutting carbon pollution 50 to 52% by 2030 and putting the nation on track to net zero emissions by 2050. C2ES is leveraging our policy expertise, our relationships with the nation's leading businesses, and our ability to bring stakeholders together to make progress on that agenda by working to pass reforms that will speed up permitting and siting for clean energy infrastructure, helping to inform the implementation of new comprehensive clean energy tax credits under the Inflation Reduction Act, removing obstacles to low carbon technologies like long duration batteries and clean hydrogen, and working with communities to build resilience to the impacts of climate change. In 2020, Joe Biden made addressing the climate crisis central to his campaign, and he's lived up to that promise as a champion for climate progress. Now is the time to double down on that commitment and make sure America remains a world leader on climate action.